Come on Rain by Karen Hesse. Pictures by John J. Muth. So here's the beautiful cover. I'm going to read a little bit from the beginning of the book here. Come on, rain, I say, squinting in the endless, into the endless heat. Mama lifts a listless vine and sighs. Three weeks and not a drop, she says, sagging over her parched plants. The sound of a heavy truck rumbles past. Uneasy, Mama looks over me, to me. Is that thunder, Tessie, she asks. Mama hates thunder. I climb up the steps for a better look. It's a truck, Mama, I say. I'm sizzling like a hot potato. I ask Mama, may I put on my bathing suit? Absolutely not, Mama frown, says, frowning under her straw hat. You'll burn all day in the sun. Up and down the block, cats pant. Heat wavers off tar patches in the broiling alleyway. I stare out over the rooftops, past chimneys, into the way off distance. That's when I see it coming, clouds rolling in, gray clouds bunched, bulging under a purple sky. Well, this book has great descriptive words. Quietly, Mama weeds and I cross the crackling dry path past Mrs. Glick's window. There she is looking into Mrs. Glick's window. The smell of hot tar and garbage bullies the air as I climb the steps to Jackie Joyce's porch. Slick with sweat, I run back home and slip up the steps past Mama. She is nearly senseless in the sizzling heat, kneeling over the hot rump of a melon. She goes to the kitchen and I pour iced tea to the top of a tall glass. I aim a spoonful of sugar into my mouth and then a second one into the drink. So she brings her mom some cool iced tea. I can visualize what that feels like. Jackie Joyce in her bathing suit knocks at the door and I let her in. Jackie Joyce has her suit on, Mama. I say, may I wear mine too? I hold my breath, waiting. A breeze blows the thin curtains into the kitchen, then sucks them back against the screen again. Um, I can really all visualize that too. Ooh, we meet in the alleyway. All the insects have gone and the trees sway under a swollen sky. The wind grows bold and bolder. And just like that, the rain comes. The first raindrops plop down big and make dust dance all around us. Then a deeper gray descends and the air cools and the clouds burst and suddenly rain is everywhere. It streams through our hair and down our backs. It freckles our feet glazes our toes. We turn in circles, glistening in our rain skin, our mouths wide. We gulp down rain. Jackie Joyce chases Rosemary, who chases Liz, who chases me. Wet slicking our arms and legs, we splash up the block, squealing and whooping in the streaming rain. We make such a racket. And suddenly the mamas all start coming out. They fling off their shoes and skim off their hose, tossing streamers of stockings over their shoulders. Our bare-legged mamas dance down the steps and join us in the fresh, clean rain, while music from Mrs. Glick's phonograph shimmies and sparkles and streaks like night lightning. Jackie Joyce, Liz, Rosemary, and I, we grab the hands of our mamas. We twirl and sway them tromping through the puddles, romping and reeling in the moist green air. We swing our wet, wild-haired mamas till we're all laughing under the trinkets of silver rain. I hug mama hard, she hugs back. As the clouds move off, I trace the drips on mama's face. Everywhere, everyone, everything is misty limbs springing back to life. We sure did get a soaking, mama, I say and we head home, purely soothed, fresh as dew,
turning back toward the fresh, sweet rays of sun. What a terrific book. I think the illustrations uh, really help you visualize what it's like in a summer rainstorm. I think students will um, can really take a look at the descriptive language in this book and use that as a jumping off point. You could even do a visualizing and verbalizing kind of exercise and read from the book and um, hear back from students of what they're imagining it must look like. Um, I love the fact that it's um, an African-American girl uh, running in the rain in the summer. Um, I hope you enjoyed it.